I've had patients actually, uh, I have, I can think of two patients who have been seeing me since 2005 and I have lived through all the entire evolution of problems, how, you know, the, the problem reoccurs and we have to get creative and do something new for them so that they can keep going, we can heal their ulcers and, and, and keep them being productive and, and happy, you know, in their lives. And how does it how does it get from you're talking about your four five and six patients uh, in as a classification that you it's it's a way of communicating and, and documenting what their prognosis what happened why right. what how do they get from it being not a problem to escalating to the four five and six uh, classification that's even another great question thank you for for asking that because I, I also had a slide on the preventable risk factors. So th this is, this may be, uh, I, I will apologize for this picture, but it shows you some of the fours and the, the one on the right is a six. This is an active ulcer. That's what they look like. The you know, it's always, I always thought it was a skin condition, but it's, it's not. It's, it's really something that's going on under the skin, in the veins that are causing these it's ulcerations, a, like a, an eruption. That's correct. It's a little bit deeper. 